Hey guys, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world one trailer at a time. Today, we're gonna look at a 2015 Aerolite model number 294 RKSS. This weighs around 6,300 pounds. It's a rear kitchen with a ton of counter space. Very, very high end finishes inside and out, especially for a 2015. I'm here with my friend, Brandon Hannemeyer today. We call him Bam Bam. Right on. <laughs> Here at the front, you got yourself a power front jack, a couple 30 pound per paint tanks, and then your battery in a box is right here. Beautiful looking front fiberglass cap. Keep in mind, this is you know six years old at this point. The painted cap still looks hot. Nice and black at the front here. Uh, we do have a nice pass through storage. There is what looks to be a weight distribution hitch in there, which you can keep uh, and use on this purchase if you like. Um, this is the Zero Gravity series. Do you think this thing like floats, Brandon? Or it does, yeah, I bet the weight's ridiculous to that. If, if it floats, we're definitely not charging enough for a, a hovercraft, but uh, fantastic. I mentioned front power jack, also four stabilizer jacks that are manual. Our Santa flush kits right here, city water connection, and a light here to help you see at nighttime when you're draining your sewer down below. Cable inlet, and then we also have a cable slide, uh, cable style slide out system, which is pulling off our couch and our dinette off the floor. As we wrap around the back side here, 30 amp uh, detachable style cord. Pardon me, 50 amp. No, the cap's wrong. Oh, funny. Okay, so this is a 30 amp trailer, but that cap says 50 amp. So 30 amp trailer. Thank you, Brendan. Furnace vent here at the back. We got ourselves uh, a spare tire here as well. We're going to cover this bad boy up with the Lazy Acre tire cover. Fridge vent, range hood vent. Coming down the door side here. Uh, the rear kitchens, they always give you a lot of door side windows, which is nice because you're looking out to our site. We got an electric awning here that starts there, covers our main door. We got LED lights in the awning, outside speakers, and like I said, look at these nice door side windows. What do you think, Brendan? 14 inch tires? Uh, I think so. Yeah, 14s. Thank you. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you, Brendan. 14 inch tires, good looking aluminum rims, three step entry, lend a hand, grab handle. She's nice. She's very nice. Let's have a look inside. Right on guys, we're inside that Aerolite 294 RKSS. We just walked in the main door. We got some things right around you don't want to talk about, but first, over here is our main slide. We have a trifold style sofa here that's gonna pull out into a bed. Uh, and then we do have windows in behind that couch with some storage here above. We also got a nice U-shaped dinette, uh, which will go to a bed as well. But check this out, we got some 20th Aerolite anniversary pictures. Love to see that. Nice windows here behind. And then uh, into our kitchen area, which is a gorgeous kitchen. Lots of counter space, lots of storage. Our pantry space is in through here. Some more storage there. Uh, six cubic foot gas electric fridge. Microwave, range hood, three burner stove top, oven down below. With a nice big pot and pan drawer down below that. Over here, we got some great storage there for garbage can or some larger items. Some nice uh, wider drawers in through here. Okay, and then all above that there, look at all this counter space, door side window, stainless steel sink, more counter space over here. Beside the microwave, there's a bunch of upper cabinets as well. Okay, all looks good there. Some more through here. And then continuing forward, we have the chairs down below, but we still have a whole lot of cabinetry here above, right across the front. This is that big door side window I was telling you about. Nice bucket style chairs, a little bit of a table in between, storage right through there. These are swivel rockers. Yeah, swivel rockers, not reclining. Now looking forward, uh, our TV's kind of in between our couch and our chairs, easy viewing, built-in DVD player, it's a Sony TV. Um, this is, uh, you know, you walk in the unit, I love this, you have nice easy access to the washroom, but we also have a spot you can put your shoes, you can hang up your jackets, and you got a, a mirror there where you can check your teeth. Now into the washroom, we do have a porcelain style toilet, lots of space here for our squat check, a little bit of storage there down below, small little plastic sink, and then a medicine cabinet here above. Awesome. Into the shower. I was surprised to see this clear. It looked like it was really tight, but they made that just right. Up and in the shower, I'm six feet tall. I can easily shower in through here, lots of height. Um, yeah, fantastic. 
Nice washroom overall. Nice and private from the bedroom and the, uh, the living space. Walking into the bedroom, the bedroom's killer. It looks super deep through here, like three or four feet between the end of the bed and the uh, wall. It's a RV King, so it's about 70 inches wide, 80 inches long. And then we got some skinny uh, hang compartments on either side. All right, with some storage here above. Okay. And then we get this bonus one over here to make up for the skinny ones beside the bed. So storage all through here with some drawers here as well. Fantastic. Hopefully you guys enjoy the video. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel, share that with your friends. You can email us here at sales at lazyacres.com or you can call us at 705-833-2539. Have a good day.